How's it going everybody? It's Gorilla Man here, back with another Car Mechanic Sim 2021 video. And as you can see here, we're back in the what I could assume is like the Nevada or Utah desert. I really don't know where we're where we're based, where we're located at. But we're gonna be doing story order number three here. It looks like it's a Volson, I think. Yeah, it's a Volson 2040. Let's see what do we got here. So Good morning. Hello, young man. Please help me. I set off my I set off on a ride and my car stopped working. It just shut down suddenly. Fortunately, some good young men towed me to your workshop. If it weren't for them, I'd rather not go into it. Please, if you can, see what you can get up with and running again. Uh, I have no idea what could have happened. Usually everything was working just fine after a six month break. Okay, so you didn't drive for six months. It's probably a problem. Thanks for setting up a workshop here in the middle of nowhere. No problem, no problem. In the meantime, please allow me to use the restroom. I'll see you soon. So you're telling me you're going to sit in the restroom while I replace your clutch. Yeah, no way, bub. This is going to be about a day's work. You're going to have to come back here for sure, for sure. All right, we're back in here. All right, so let's go to the examination mode. Yeah, yeah, that's a lot of... Uh, See, that's your, that's your problem right there. Pull this out. Oh, they added fluid to it. Dang it. Well, that's $50, uh, $50 out the drain. I guess I'll just remove off all this front stuff first. Get to what I can pretty simply. Water pump. I guess you probably got to remove... You probably got to remove the, uh, the power... Not the power steering pump. What is it? Probably gonna remove the all the coolant stuff, even if you want to remove the. Uh... Yeah, even if you want to remove the water pump, I guess. I'd, I'd be really blank in here. All right, alternator. I guess you want to remove that part of it. Looks like our starter's bad, so he somehow got it running with the bad starter. Oil filter looks terrible. It, really weird, weird wear patterns here, as you can see. Fuel filter is gone. It's like one in every 10 parts is just looking a little bit worse for wear. All right, we'll get her up in the air, take a look. Hey, maybe there'll be no more tires or brakes or suspension work because that's the stuff I don't like. Um, it does look like though, I am going to have to remove the clutch. If I read that right, I think it said clutch plate or something like that, which means the tranny has to come out. Let's spray this. Get these. Oh, if you guys notice, I am level three now. I did spend a little bit of time. Fuel pump's bad also. I did spend a little bit of time working on extra stuff here and there. I've just been doing a couple missions. Um, but honestly, until I get a lot of money or I unlock more parts of the shop, um, I'm pretty limited just to like refilling stuff, changing out a couple parts here and there. Those bolts look rusty. Yes, they do. But yeah, I'm pretty much limited to just changing out a few parts here and there. Which kind of sucks, but I am uh, working through it as as I can. Spread this out. Definitely, if I could hit like 500 credits or something like that, or if I could just hit the junkyard and be able to just repair cars at my own leisure, I'm sure I'd be making way, way more money. Plus, I got to test some more money-making methods that I could have in this new game compared to the old one it was down bad good i think this one's good is that a rusted bolt that's not that's a good bolt okay let me hop over here looks like the clutch release bearing is bad and looks like the clutch plate itself is bad not the pressure plate but the plate or the clutch i should say I think the flywheel looks pretty good. All right, let's check this out. Fuel pump, already done. Oil filter, timing belt, spark plug, serpentine. Okay, simple stuff. Let's get this put back together then. I don't know if there's a transmission shop. Uh, nope, looks like it's just main shop, which is nice. But I can get this stuff starting, or started to put, started to be put back together. Uh, do I have an oil filter? I don't, okay. I'll put this on, I'll put the bearing on, and then I'm going to get a uh, oil filter and a starter. Throw this on. Okay, let's go get a 
oil filter for an i4 so let's see what type of starters we have oh it's electrical starter uh, looks like we just got the casual v8 and normal starters as per use that on nope nope there we go put this back on so yeah the I was looking about how the progression would work in this game guys and it's really really heavily based on just what you purchase for your shop what shop upgrades you'd get um i think some of you guys probably should have the game roughly today the time of posting this so some of you guys will be able to see when you go to sandbox mode i am still yet to go to sandbox mode um just because i really want to play through the single player game before i ever tried that plus honestly late single player you're pretty much in your own sandbox and it's really 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 fun uh let's see fuel pump fuel filter idler roller initial okay i think we can lower that back down click on this back out let's see also having something to repair with would be really really nice uh we are in the electronic shop oh wait no maybe electronic shop has the alternators they do car parts let's get our water pump for the i4 our pump pulley is what i believe was wrong get our radiator c i didn't see a i didn't see a fan on the front of the radiator but i guess the water pump i4 maybe i bought the wrong one looks like i did water pump i4 i forgot that you can really just do this you can go into car status find the thing that you're looking for say i need a cam gear um you take me there market actually no market does that put it in my list uh open shopping list nothing in the shopping list okay so you got to go in and market i guess which i guess i could do from here i can mark everything i need in here oh also yeah i forgot there's another case so we'll do two case openings in this so fingers crossed on another i think did i buy any rollers i did not so fingers crossed on us getting buy five of these five of these on us getting another barn find because we have one and i would love to be getting multiple wait a second did i see this stuff all needs to be replaced i forgot that's something that we can do we can just go through and just mark all super nice super simple shows us everything if you zoom out so i'll take off this camshaft pulley and then take off this roller that we just put on i know i know i messed up though now i think we can take this off uh belt tensioner comes off first looks like we're gonna need another timing belt and another gear so the easiest way to, for me to go about purchasing these things is actually really really simple just go hover over it hit space 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 go exit t open up your shopping list click on what you need double tap tab click on what you need double tap enter tab click on what you need double tap enter super simple super quick extremely useful if you're working on especially on cars you've never worked on before which is what i am basically working with here uh, no you're wrong this is pretty similar to the other engines that i worked on in uh 18 but yeah all right rollers on now do i have another one of these belts i don't so go to inventory uh scroll down mark mark have all those exit tab okay tab click double enter good i love that i love that feature Now, did I buy a belt? Do I even need a belt tensioner here? Doesn't look like it. Put the radiator on. Um, go with some things we gotta take apart. We gotta take apart the ignition wires. And it looks like we need all new spark plugs. I guess I probably shouldn't mark these things because the outline is really messing with me. Let me go back in here and demark.
I guess I'll keep these relays marked, but everything else though can get out of here. So go back to inventory and add. I guess I should only add one of those, honestly, but whatever. Uh, wow, where did this? Okay, there it is. Uh huh, I see. You gotta go to the electronic shop to find these. Um, we're gonna purchase four of these. I do have some extra ones lying around, but I'm not too sure what the condition they are in is. I've already spent about $1,000 working on this so far. Ooh, new achievement unlocked, new and shiny. Probably means like buy over a hundred new parts or something like that is what I'd assume. And then after this is done, I think I gotta change some oil and stuff like that and then it is good to go Let's see fuel filter all right check for that and then just the relays and the relays are something i haven't touched on yet so we need relay a and b whoa these fuses are cool okay i think we're in the electronic shop though um relay Type A and B. So big boy and small boy. It's fat boy and little boy. All right, cover is on. Check status. So change oil, drain and refill. Change everything and refill one. Okay, I'll refill the one I know. There we go, there we go. I can refill this one and then I know to change every other one, including oil. I gotta drain the oil, so I'll pop this guy back in the air before I do that. Oh, you know what I also realized? I don't have any music coming. There we go. All right, uh, we'll get this in the air first. We'll get the oil drain over here. There we are. Drain, I don't want to take any more, uh, what, do you, what would you call it? Taxes on not doing it. Took a big hit earlier by messing up and pulling the radiator out. That's a good thing to realize, though. You got to take out the radiator uh, before you want to do any of the other stuff. And now while we're here, we will do a drain of all of the major fluids. This one. And then there should be one more, right? There, here, there. Maybe not. Coolant. Oh, I forgot. I already. Yep. I already uh, absolutely dumped the coolant everywhere. So what is this? It's a 50 50 mix of coolant. <laughs> it cleans, cools and prevents. I think I just realized the music shut off again. Weird. I'm going to have to go check that. Okay, hold on, let me. Hmm. Maybe it's a bug every single time you move the car up and down, it cuts you off. Alrighty. And one more fluid. The oil. I didn't put oil in yet, so. With the classic soup oil. One, a two, a three. Maybe it's the station. It's got to be the station that's doing it. That's really bizarre. Well, it looks like we are already 74% condition. I definitely did that. All of these things are good to go. All right. Let's slap the hood. Send her on our way. Oh, what? Over bushing is missing. I removed a rubber bushing I didn't have to remove. Didn't I? I did. Oh, it was a 75, that was why. It looked way worse, though. Alright. There we go, center on the way. 202 experience from that story mission. Wow, that's a pretty good one. We have another one here that is the Hinata Moon Mark 1 Sunrise, which looks pretty cool. Then this one. Ooh, actually, let me do this one really quick. When I see random ones that have, um, so when you look at it in the order, 
Oh, where can I see it at? Is it up here? Yeah, so it'll have this highlighted right here, which is a bonus 25% experience. So instead of getting like 50, you get, what would that be? Like 63 and a half or something like that. Totally worth it though. Do we break 10K? Ooh, eight and a half. Uh, let's see. Oh, wait, do I have multiple? I do have multiple cases now. All right, let's sort by condition and let's open some cases. Okay, so pick two, pick two, barn find. Dang it, barn find, bonus credit. So it's credits, interesting. What is this one though? Is that scrap? All right, give it to me, give me the barn find, center. Mm, that's a good one, but barn find. Oh my gosh. All right, well, let's, um, oh, I hit V. Okay, there we go. I think I hit V and it lagged me. All right, let's sell all the parts below 90 some percent. 59, 90, how many? Okay, we got one left. Let me see here. Is there ever an option in here? It gives you the, your ability to view, a, gives you ability to expect value of a car. Okay, part examination, mysterious case after finishing an order. That's a really good one. That is, that one is actually insane. Um, parking alley cheaper, 5% discount. So I don't have any that lets you, that lets you get two or gets you three cards or four cards instead of two from the cases, which kind of sucks. That'd be a really cool one if they would add that in. Um, would I already have one? Okay. Well, I know this has braking problems. So, let's see. Okay, I see the braking problems. What does this say? ABS pump module, brake caliper, and pads. All right. Well, pretty simple. Brake, two pads, uh, a caliper. We go to electronics shop, and we go to ABS parts. We buy the main pump, the module. Let me click on these. And now these are like the expensive parts that are like a couple hundred, like seven to 900, like alone. So I'll probably try and keep these if I can actually remember to until I can unlock the repair bench, repair them for like a hundred or two, and then pocket like an extra 800 credits out of, or not here, probably pocket like an extra 500 credits out of just holding on to them and then repairing them later on. Because I do know you were able to repair them in the old version. All right, let's see, let's see. Who's got the bad parts? All right, close that. Okay, so this one's got a bad part. I guess we'll just move around. Uh, that one's fine. That one's fine. And then this one is bad caliper and break it appears. Makes my job a little bit easier. All right, pop that. I guess I really did underestimate the amount of time it took me to get level 50 in CMS 18. I am level four already, but this is also like the third video, which is pretty crazy. All right, new caliper. I think the piston was good, yep, or the cylinder. All right, get the retro rims back on this. Get this bad boy up and running in little to no time. And then be front left. I do believe that is the brake pad in there in question. This one's good though. This one tells you what it is. Uh, later on, I'm sure like it did in the old game, uh, they'll avoid telling you what the problem is. But since I don't have the, uh, what do you call it? The brake pad or the testing pad? Yeah, the testing pad. Uh, they won't do that to you yet, I don't believe. But yeah, no, these are the missions that I've just been doing um, just in my free time. I'll do like five every here and there. Uh, just jammed out some breaks, see if I can get some bonus points off of it. And pretty much all I have to, uh, all I, all I have to do. Because the story missions are definitely the things that, uh, are definitely the things that pay the most in every aspect. All right. Send her out the door, 31 experience, and a couple thousand. I think that was like 700 credits I just earned there. 
uh, pretty solid. And then go back to this. We have a more ready. Okay, okay. So, ooh, I just got experience, life lesson. Uh, let's see. So none of these are giving us any bonus, which makes me want to... I'll usually, like, let them, like, go out. Especially if they got, like, stuff like this, like, harder stuff to work on. I definitely want the ex bonus experience if I'm going to work on it. Um, but I'll accept this story order. And this looks like an old Mitsubishi Eclipse, I do believe, or a Prelude? Or a Prelude? One of the two. Definitely one of the two. But we're going to hold off on working on this just yet, guys, because we're going to save this one for the next video because we're coming up on our time here. Thank you guys for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like and a comment down below. Um, I'm going to be pumping out these videos probably almost once a day, guys. I know I didn't post one yesterday, but I'm definitely going to be trying to post them every single day. Um, just because I've, I'm really enjoying this game so far and I really, really want to get in like the progression and I'm almost at 10k and once I hit that 10k mark, then I'll be able to actually, you know, upgrade the garage and see what type of stuff I can start unlocking. I really want to get the paint booth unlocked. That's easy money. Um, car wash, be watch people's cars, easy money, stuff like that. Just, just little simple stuff like that. But thank you guys for watching and subscribe if you guys subscribed yet and I'll see you in the next car mechanic simulator video.